Welcome back to a new video of Isaac Calvenith Art Classroom. Today I'm going to teach you how to work the slide presentation for your assignment this term. Uh, the first thing I want you to do is click, well this is my slide presentation software, uh, of LibreOffice Impress is for free so you can download it from the internet and, 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 and I'm going to drag box and paste a text I have already written in, in order to go faster so let's imagine these are the two members of, of the uh, the couple uh, that is going to give the presentation okay uh, let's go to the browser I have already set up this this web page is Wikimedia Commons you already know it from another video uh, it's very convenient because most of the images you are going to find here are uh, free of rights, rights free mm, I'm going to, to search clicking on the search engine in the page uh, my criteria is uh, painting paintings of Venus Let's imagine I'm looking for images related to this topic. I get plenty of results that you can see here below, uh, organized in uh, by different uh, categories. Okay, I'm going to click on Renaissance paintings because I like Renaissance very much. Uh, again, um, you have here upwards some reading results and some thumbnails. You scroll down the page you're going to find several of them but uh, I don't like them I, I prefer click in on Sleeping Venus by George Arnold remember you always have to write the title and the author well this is clicking on the thumbnail on the uh, left side I, I got to a uh, full view of the, of the image on the lowest right corner you have uh, an icon you click on on it and you get this pop-up menu and this is one of the most important things in your uh, work download original file I don't recommend you to click this option just click on the tiny pointing down arrow that is on the right and select large large is a pretty good quality image but it's not going to take you up too much space in your hard drive. I click left click with my button, my, my, my mouse and get this pop-up menu. Save file uh, because you have two options. The, the best one is save file because I want to store it in my computer. This is my pictures uh, folder. You can needless to say save your image anywhere in your hard drive. Um, leave the, 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 the same name you get and just click save this is your first image you got it okay I'm going to get back in my brochure to the original result uh, let's think I want to to keep going with the birth of Venus mm -hmm. where well you have like here plenty of information but what I'm looking for is the image so I click on it and I again get to this place click on this bottom and I click the large option cl left click with the mouse and with the save option active you select the file the folder is going to be the same save and again I'm going back to mm, the main results I get Titian Venices is going to be my last option this one is going to work perfectly well for what I'm looking for so large again click on the right green button and save file again save ok I get my three files I come back to my software and I'm going to click insert th this menu image and this is one of the best options you can select no matter whether you are working with uh, Microsoft 
PowerPoint, PowerPoint or this uh, LibreOffice Impress, the options are quite similar. I get this uh, Create Photo Album. I'm going to click on Add. Well, okay, I have this mm, folder, it's my pictures folder in my documents, and I have my the three here, the three images I get. I'm going to select all of them. You can pressing holding down the shift key you can click on the first and last images and I'm going to select all of them I'm going to click open and insert slides okay slide layout one image this is the option you must and you can see that just by means of one strike I get my three images finished I'm perfectly ready for showing uh, remember, uh, you must do it to write again here below the image the author and the title. If you don't remember it, go back to the net in order to get the uh, proper information. Uh, um, the last thing you have to do is to uh, save the file. I'm going to I'm going to save it um, in my documents for example and this is one of the most important things since I am Francisco remember I'm going to write Francisco this is the name Francisco D S because these are the first letter of my two family names blank space Elena S key blank space again third D okay you can also erase this blank space in between your first name and your f uh, the first letters of your family names um, just click save okay of course you can select here the kind of the, the type of, of file you're going to to work with for instance you have PowerPoint presentation PPDX this is one of the standard kind of of uh, files so you want a shareable fully shareable uh, file you should select this option click on save and you will get it and um, in order to deliver your work you are going to send it to me by means of uh, uh, for an, uh, in uh, an email I'm going to give you my email address or also to bring it by means of a pen drive or something like that well that's all I hope everything I told you today comes in handy to you in order to better understand what I want you to do. Uh, okay folks, see you later. So long.